This is a short tutorial on how to do matrix multiplication and matrix inversion in Excel specifically to solve a linear system of equations and unknowns. Uh, so I've set up my matrices here. So my A matrix that has the coefficients for the equations. Uh, this would be a two equations, two unknowns. And I just put some random values in here for the A matrix. Uh, so it'll be A times X. This will be what I solve for equals B, the right hand side here, and again I just made up values here. So uh, to solve this I need to take A inverse times B. Uh, so the first thing is to find A inverse. So I need to make an empty set of cells that's the same size as the A matrix. Uh, it has to be square. Uh, it also has to be invertible or it'll throw an error. Uh, I can show that here in a second. Uh, the command is M inverse. Uh, it's a little bit tricky to apply it. So to find the inverse of this, you need to select all four cells where you want the inverse to show up. Type equal min first. Do the open parentheses. Select the A matrix. And then here's the trick. You have to do control shift enter. And it will populate the A inverse. To do matrix multiplication, the command is M mult, so it's the same thing. So I want to take the A inverse times B to get my answer. So I'm going to come up here to where I want the answer, and I need to select both of these cells. And I'm going to do equal M mult. I'm going to put the first, the open parentheses. Uh, it's A inverse, so I'm going to select all of these, comma, select the B uh, vector and then I'm going to control shift enter and it's going to give me the uh, solution to this in this case so A times X is going to equal B so these would be the the uh, first and second uh, and the, the two unknowns solve for in my uh, linear system uh, and this works for any basic linear system it's got to be square it's got to be invertible if I uh, make some of these random values like in this case if I do two zeros in here it becomes uninvertible uh, if you get this uh, you've probably made a mistake if you've applied the control shift enter correctly uh, and it's giving you errors it's an uninvertible and you probably made some errors in your A matrix uh, it's easy to validate this one times negative a third plus two times uh, one and two third uh, that's going to give us three. Three times negative a third gives us negative one plus three times one and two third gives us uh, five. Negative one plus five gives us four. So it's easy to easy to validate the results once once you've got them. But uh, it's pretty simple. Uh, again, the commands are minverse and mmult. Uh, the control shift enter is is the key. You can find other tutorials online. Uh, but uh, once you have the once you have know the trick, it actually works pretty quick. Thank you.